Hello and welcome back to Gnome Regards Journey. We are in Plane of Knowledge and we're about to continue our Frostfell adventures. Uh, the quest we're going to try to do today is called the Frost Claw, Claw, Frost Claw Lair. One take. I don't do multiple takes. <laughs> so there we go. Uh, this, this is the guy right here that's going to give us the quest, hopefully. Uh, now that we finished the other quest last episode. So let's go ahead and hail him. All right. We'd already read all this. I don't want to read it again. War. Willing. Ah, oh, son of a gun. All right, so that's the quest from last episode. Willing. All right, we need to add a player to the group. Give me a few moments. All right, now we have uh, two other group members, a uh, random low-level character I had, uh, which might may or may not work. Uh, let's try Willing again. All right, so too low. So let me camp this character out. This whole thing, <laughs> having the extra characters is so annoying to uh, just spawn a mission. There we go, we got the mission, yay. All right, so all we have to do is head to Permafrost Keep and then zone in normally and then it will uh, it will zone us into a instance version. So I'm gonna run off to Permafrost Keep and we'll go from there. Okay, so this is kinda cool. I just ran into Santa Ugg. So I guess he's coming to town. He just shrunk me. Well, that's pretty neat. I don't know, I don't, he's got a plan, I guess. Shout's coming to town. All right, so I'm gonna keep running over to Permafrost and we'll do that. All right, so that was weird. I zoned in. I walked like five steps forward, and then it zoned me into a new zone. All right, here we go. Now we're inside of this one. This is the uh, instance version, so... We're just getting, like, swamped by uh, these low-level goblins. And they're dropping really nice stuff. There we go. All right, so it looks like it's a whole different like little instance here. Lots of goblins. This is a group, uh, a group mission, and uh, so hopefully that worked. Yeah, I read on uh, Alakazam that if you kill these cages with spell damage, they. Uh, they won't work. Like, you won't get credit for them. So, we gotta... Gotta use real damage. On them. Alright. That's... Those. Is there another cage over here? Let's keep going. not look like there is one there. Did I miss a cage over on this side? No, I got all the cages up here. Is there one over on this side still? I guess not. Let's uh, keep going here. I guess we'll go down towards Vox's lair. All right, we go this way. It's like nothing up over here, so. All right, I always, I always get uh, discombobulated here, so it's like that way, that way. There it is. <laughs> I just wondering, I guess it was Voxlayer. 
where the final, uh, oh jeez, look at this, well, goodbye friends. Oh, and there's the, uh, final guy. It's, uh, oh, he's already dead. And the final cage with our friend Santa Lug. There we go. And we completed the quest. And we got missing gifts complete. So it's just complete one of those and that. And those were... Uh, that's why we couldn't do them. I just realized that. Uh, those were uh, different level ranges and this is that one. So there we go. That one is done. That didn't take very long at all. What did we get from that? We got a... Frost Goblin Illusion Mask. Alright. I don't know if that's going to overwrite. No, it won't. Uh, let's see here. Where is it? Skeletal. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Oh. Look at that evil face on this little goblin here. Oh, he's <laughs> here with the rocks cooking. Yeah, I think, didn't the rock used to do that? I don't remember. All right, so now we need to go to uh, this one here. And this is in Beast Domain. Let me check the map real quick. Because I can go to City of Bronze. Actually, going from the Guild Hall is going to be faster. So let me get to Beast Domain and we'll uh, show up there. All right, <laughs> finally. <laughs> uh, here is the uh, Goblin. Uh, so yeah, I, I went through the, uh, er, uh, Arg city of Argoth, whatever, uh, zone, uh, but the guy's down here, so it would have been faster <laughs> to, uh, go from, uh, city of bronze to respond resplendent temple to, uh, Sethir city, but here we are. Hail him, uh, Suntug's helper sent you to help us. It eyes you critically. Hmm, no good as bait. Raxy like leafy things. It scratches its ear th thoughtfully for a moment. Fung says, you go about saying, tell, sell, tell him we need stronger ropes and equipment to keep the Braxy under control. Oh my gosh, all that just to go back to be okay. All right. All right, we're back here at Santa Clog's helper. Go ahead and hail him. Dig Gobbies already has the, all the rope we got. He starts to turn away, dejected. When a nearby gnome pipes up excitedly, you see you need to catch something? Catch? That gnome, he thinks he seems to think he can help, but I don't know. You guys see what he wants. All right. Hail him. Does a Sandog's helper need a little help himself? I've got a device I use back home all the time to catch the Phaedrics. I bet a little fine tuning, though, I could build one that would work on Braxy. Build? I don't carry all the necessary components on me at all times, but I do have a small supply of tools and parts as it happens. He indicates to a tool toolbox near his feet, nearly as large as himself. I only need a few things. A few things. All right. Let's see where to begin. Sword into his collection. So we'll need a bag, a rod, and of course, the mana. Oh, and I'm out of tubing. Looks like he stands up abruptly to earnest you. All right, make this simple. I'll write down some things for you. That journal looking thing you have should work. All right, so we need a bottle of vicious mana, a class one mana battery, a rod of mystical transfer, and shark tubing, and a trader satchel. So all of that stuff is actually pretty easy to get. I already have the rod because someone cast it on me at some point in time during, <laughs> during my online session. Uh, so we need shark. So we need shark tubing. We need two of these. One, two. And then we need a mana battery. Uh, mana batteries are on a different one, aren't they? We need a class one mana battery. Do I already have some in my bank? Class one mana battery bank. All right, let's grab one out of there real quick. It's a different building for the other guy. All right, find item, mana, search, uh, grab item, 
I just need one of those. How to make those. All right. Close that. So we have, oh, I, oh, we have to deliver it. All right. That, 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 that. We need a vial of vicious mana. Uh, one of these. Wrap item. Conveniently, I made a million of these for crafting All kinds of nonsense. And we need a trader satchel. Do we have a trader satchel? I know we have a lot of trader satchels, uh, but they're all in use. All right, so let's go over to the bazaar and grab a trader satchel. Oh my God, it's like lag fest over here. All right, we're in the bazaar. The trader satchels can be bought from this man right here. I'm assuming it's just a plain trader satchel. So we'll grab that, put it over here, that, and that. So those are the... Uh, where'd that tubing go? Uh, is that it? There it is. All right, let's put that right there. So, all right, I'm gonna head back to uh, that gnome, and we'll go from there. Zoptic, Zoptic is his name. All right, we're back at him. Let's go ahead and hand him all of these items. are those and the final mana nice oh good <laughs> clicked right through there we go we got something else what is this braxy encapsula collapsulator device kill eight hungry predators use the device on a skittish braxy all right so we need to go back to beast domain uh i think the quickest way for me to get there at this point would be to use the harbinger staff uh, which is a uh, collector's item from one of the collector's editions. All right, back in Beast's domain. Now we need to go kill eight hungry predators and use the uh, use the item on a few uh, things. Wow, these are still green at uh, one sixteen. Can my pet even sell all these things? <laughs> what is he doing over there? Alright, let's get a dot on there just to speed that up. Wow, that didn't work, did it? There we go. Come on. I'll take that. Actually, I don't think we need her anymore, so let's kick her out of the group. There we go. And if we do, I can log them back in. All right. So let's put him on G hold for now. I don't want to deal with random moms. So we got to find these predators and stuff. It says North Central. So I think right around here is where we got to go. All right. We're more in the uh, center of the zone now. And, uh, we start finding, uh, finding these mobs that we need to kill. All right. I got a huge tra train of mobs on me at the moment. Uh, summon companion. There we go. Chunk of obsidian. What is that nonsense? Trash. All right. So we need to use the uh, bag on this one. So we got an open slot, we can uh, click it. There we go, one. Oh, we got two. All right. Not sure how that works, but whatever. Uh, I think these actually have to be called a hungry predator to uh, count. Yeah, they have to be called that. So this is all junk, if I recall, right? Uh, these are uber raptors. Uh, there we go. Hungry predator. Oh, they're like extremely weak. There's a sick one. 
Terrible Raptor. Terrible Raptor. Uh, let's go over this side. Oh, we got Wart over there. There's a skittish Braxy. Here's the bag on him. There we go. We got another one. So this stuff's no joke. I just lost my mercenary messing around with this giant train of mobs. No joke. Uh, kind of hilarious. Actually got to heal my pet. So many mobs. I thought it, I thought at this point they would be uh, completely trivial, uh, but they are still uh, still green, which is kind of hilarious. But I'm not finding any more of these mobs. Is that one right there? A hungry predator? Yes, it is. Come on, pet swarm attack that thing. All right, I'm just going to go ahead and dot this one up so I don't have to uh, do anything. There's another Abraxy. All right, we're at two and four. So I'm going to go ahead and get all these knocked out real quick, and then we'll come back and uh, go do re the rest of the quest turn-ins. All right, I've caught all the Abraxy, and now we're down to this last Hungry Predator, which will... Uh, complete that and we got another one aggroed on us so let's go ahead and kill it seems to be any of the mobs can spawn as a hungry version all right so we need to take this back to uh the guy at the zone in so let's levant uh necros can levant uh secure to the secure point in the location which uh in the, in the zone that is that uh will uh Pretty much where this guy spawns, so it saves us a lot of time. Uh, he's like right over here. All right, so we need to give him the bag and give that there. And he gave it back to us. Now we need to go back to POK and let me find get back to POK and get to send Ugg. All right, we're back in POK and we're at Ascent Og Clog's Helper. Let's go ahead and uh, turn this into him. Hooray, Frostfell has been saved. Whoa, what is all this nonsense? <laughs> Jesus. We have a lot of choices here. Uh, all right, looks like we get to choose some um, augments or some not augments, but uh, Preview. Uh, we gotta drop, drop the illusion. Preview. Oh, that is a nice robe. What? All right. What do these weapons look like? Uh, so we use a dagger. Let's go ahead and preview that. Oh, it's got like snow on it. That's pretty cool. Uh, what about the great staff? Oh, that's pretty cool. Uh, what about the helm? I have helm turned off. <laughs> Looks like that guy right there. Uh, it's okay. Uh, let's grab the robe because I can put that in the, uh, the, what you call it. So there we go. We get, uh, we get 0.1% of an experience. There we go. All right. So another one down. Uh, here, let's, let's put that on. Oh, it's tradable. So it means I can, uh, I could buy it from anybody. There we go. Boom. That looks cool. All right. Uh, let's take a look. I think I think that's all for this episode. But I want to see where we're where we're at. Right. 
Uh, let's turn off the ones that we've already completed. Let's open these back up. Let's bristle pain day. All right. We started with seven. Now we're down to one, two, three, four. So we got three achievements down. Uh, let's see here. So I don't think we can do these ones yet. So we'll have to look into that. So we need to go to what looks like the Great Divide. There's another guy in Plain of Knowledge somewhere. And then uh, some stuff in Timorous Deep. But I'm pretty sure this adorable Yeti doll is broken. Uh, there's a f large post on the uh, bug report forum saying that. So, uh, yeah. All right. Well, we made we made some significant progress. Three of seven down, and uh, yeah, just a little bit more to go. So, uh, thank you for watching, and have a fantastic day.